Hello and thank you so much for joining me today. This is Maxi Limit. If you are new to the channel, make sure that you subscribe and hit the bell notification icon. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for the support. Uh, today is the almost the end of the month. So uh, normally what I do every end of the month, I clean up my desk. What I mean by clean up my desk is I for sure clean up the desk. But the most important part here is cleaning up my computer. You know, as time goes on, uh, your computer build up dust and it is very very important to uh, make sure that you clean up at least once every month or two because what happens is if you don't clean them up uh, build up a lot of dust and that is not good for the performance your fans gonna uh, spin more which will uh, reduce his uh, lifetime and also the heat on to the computer so today as every month I'll be doing the cleanup of that computer and I wanted to show you how I actually do it. This is my way of doing it, and I'm sure that this also will work for you. Now, if uh, you do that regularly, at least once um, per month or once every two months, your computer should not be that dirty. Because if it's dirty, then you have to go deeper by removing cards, fans, and etc. So to avoid all that, to avoid messing around with the equipment inside of your computer, make sure you clean up your computer every single month that being said let's start so I have removed all the connections and cables uh, from the PC but before we start I want to show you how dirty it is even though I just cleaned this one month ago okay sorry if the camera shakes a little bit I have to move it around so as you can see, um, this is uh, my PC. It's an Omen uh, desktop, and then it is uh, a powerful machine. You see, we have so much dust already building up on top and uh, inside of the uh, of the PC here. Um, that's why it is very very important to uh, to clean it up. I don't know if you can see it here at the back. It's not bad, but uh, you see, it's already building up a lot, a lot, a lot of dust. Especially on top here, as you can see, it's messy here. So the tools that we need to be able to clean that this, we're gonna need uh, this one, which is the uh, electronic duster. They call it, and a kind of uh, cloth. This is gonna clean up the outside. Don't use this inside of the PC, okay? So let's start. So on some of the uh, the computers, uh, you don't need screwdriver. But on some of them, you do need screwdriver to be able to open the case. On this specific uh, model, we do not need a screwdriver. So I'm going to show you how we can open that up. At the back of the PC, on top, I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, on top here we do have a button, uh, some some kind of a push mechanism so once i push this the, oh actually we do have a lock so this side this, this side actually will lock it so i will have to push it over there and then it's unlocked and the only thing i have to do is just to simply press here and then as you can see the uh, the cover pops up here we go but before we open actually the uh, the desktop you want to quickly clean the outside so gently and quickly we can quickly clean up the, uh, the PC remove any dust any dust that have built up during the past month right so after a little clean up from the outside then we could uh, also quickly open it and start cleaning inside so once we are okay with the uh, with the dust outside, then we can put the rug aside and then press the button and open it up. Uh, I got locked it away. There we go. Then on this model again, it's very easy to open it and then you can lift it up. And as you can see, this is the a giant PC really it is so so big let me zoom in and you can see exactly how it is inside there we go 
this is an omen uh, desktop uh, basically you want to spray and normally it goes from up down so because if i start praying spraying here now most of this task here will go up but i don't want that i want to start spraying from up so basically when you start spraying uh, the dust will come out you can actually see the dust sorry for the noise but don't spray too much on the fans because eventually the fan will turn it's gonna be nice for you to see the fan turn but don't spray too much inside because the rpm of the fan will go so high it might damage the fan so just go easy don't let it spin too much the main purpose here is not to damage any electronic component, is to remove the dust. So quickly, just spray everywhere. You will eventually see, you will eventually see the dust coming out. You see? And if you see that it's not coming out properly, uh, you can try to, to, to burn it a little bit down like this. So my GTS card is here, but basically the fans are down. So what I normally do is I'll lift it up a little bit. I don't know if you can see it. Let me adjust the, uh, the camera a little bit here. There we go. I will, uh, I will lift it up a little bit like this to be able to have a sex to the fan. Now, the only thing you want to know, so this can have some liquid inside. So never shake it or or turn it on the side, just always keep it straight. my pc is not that dirty that's why uh, it was easy and, and very fast for me to clean up otherwise you will need two cans of the electronic dust to be able to clean it up okay you have to go every corner and you have to go deep inside now let's say if this pc was not clean for the past let's say year or two there will be <laughs> so much dust that even the uh, the electronic duster cannot remove so in that case what you need to do you need to start removing component um, um, like you can remove this is the um, the, mem the memory card basically you don't need to remove it but if you want to clean this the the slot you might want to remove it especially the the graphic card you might want to remove it and in that case you will need to remove the screws here to be able to take it out and then again if you don't know how to do it then you might want you might damage the uh, the PC so the best thing to do is simply try to uh, to clean up like the way I did it every single month and that way your PC will remain always clean okay now if you want to see this PC when I bought it I did an unboxing and review about it I will link the description I will link the video in the card or in the description down below so you might want to to check it out okay so once we are done with the cleaning and we are happy about it, all we need to do is to put the cover back. You see the cover inside is very, very clean and the only thing we need is just to cover it back. So uh, on this particular case here, it's very easy. You just have to put it in like this and then it's get in place. And so that is basically how I clean my PC, okay? Make sure you do that yourself once a month or at least once every two months. Alright, this will conclude today's video. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment down below. This is Maxi Limit signing out.